Hello, anyone and everyone. Welcome to Entral Plays Star Renegades. Turn this down a little right here. So this, the volume on this game is ridiculous. So I keep trying to jostle it and change it uh, because I heard how loud it was the first time I tried to record. Because guess who had his mic muted? Like every time. It's me. But uh, here we are, and for some reason, the volume. How to explain that? My name is Every Game Studio, and I like to turn my volume at a max. I mean, I get it. The very cool the soundtrack is very powerful. I, in fact, I might have made it too low, but you guys might not have heard it that well. So I highly recommend watching Cinematic again. Yeah, but hello, anyone and everyone. This is Ed Troll playing Star Renegade. Renegades? Yeah, Renegades. Over oh, Norash, a small force of mysterious raiders destroy the mighty Star Union Armada. <coughs> oh my god, I'm dying. The surviving starfighters attempt to regroup, pursued by the relentless enemy squadrons. Alright. I actually don't know much about this game. My buddy recommended it to me, and I didn't look into it like I normally do with games. And I just know it's a roguelike, and it's supposed to be dope. And that soundtrack was awesome. And there's Max. Please answer me. Let me know if you're still alive. I'm fine. Hey, that's me. Yeah, those enemy fighters are good, really good. I'm lucky I managed to land in one piece. I watched that anime. You get points for missing all those buildings. Ah, Zub Zub Crud. <laughs> I hate Zub Zub Crud, you know what I mean? I got more of those fighters on my tail. Where are they all coming from? Uh, I landed in, uh, by the train for Garon. If I, or Garon. If I can get back to the base in time, you can get those anti-aircraft guns online. My thoughts exactly. That'd be a nice surprise for these fighters following me. Great plan, I'll come when I get the base over and out. That base. Alright, this is cool, so I just click, click. Oh sure, this government tells us these mysterious fleets just appear out of nowhere. Next thing you know, they pass some laws, come to the massive stock was making the Oh alright, well huh, well who'd have thought the Norris would ever really close a fight like this is and right before tourist season also, I'll be ruined. Yep, dust. Thank you for your sir. Th thank you for your service, man, but can you please send someone to clear some smoking rain for your children here? Yeah, yeah, I'll be there in a second, food. Just chill. You know, strange signature on the train, so telling me they aren't meters. Raiders of God for 2A. Ooh, this is what combat looks like. Let me see how they are at hand to hand combat. Prepare to meet my doom. Your. I think you meant your doom. Oh, no, never mind. This will be a chin. So I'll take him out with cleave. Combat sorry, is a deterministic, meaning you can see your enemy's action before they execute, allowing you to defend, crit, stagger, or break them. Alright. All action is played on the time limit according to their execution time. It's for instant action, which are, you know, instant. The unit's current health is shown uh, in the stats bar above their heads and the colonists uh, you know, uh, and cone, or co, con, uh, coexist of shields, health armor. Oh my god, I'm... Any effects are also displayed above uh, the stats bars. On enemies you can see the action they are going to execute. Shield regenerate at the end of every combat. Health and armor can be increased or healed during camping or... From health and armor crates found during your mission. Sorry, guys, I'm pretty sure I just lost every viewer based off of that reading. And you know, it's nice to have you there. Right, here's my abilities. I, obviously, I'm gonna have to use Flea, but I just wanna see what I can do. Stats, that was cool. Sorry for units, inspect units. Let's be inspecting. Alright, whatever. Shot me. Alright, so is that my cleave? Okay. He may be dumb, but I should probably hit him before he hits me. I'll recalibrate and trick him with a slash. Crit occurs when a unit is, is hit before they can use their action. Execute their action. 
Create a bonus that is applied is shown below the attacking tower's main information. Which can do extra damage, break the enemy's attack, fear shields or armor, damage armor, or have other devastating effects. Be careful though, enemies can also crit your heroes if they are hit before they can execute their action. Alright, so I mean obviously slash. That'll hit him and it'll knock back his action. Ooh, get crit on, exactly. Crit shield down, crit, now you can take his action. Alright. They got his you know, smash him with a hue to break him and stall his attack. Action stagger and enemies action. So yeah, we just saw that. Delaying it to execute later. I mean, delaying it to execute later in the round. Allowing your squad to execute more crits. Okay, cool. So you can stagger. Yeah, stagger crits. With careful funny you can chant text together to land multiple staggers on enemies, break them by pushing them into the next round. However, enemies can have a stagger limit denoting how many times they can be staggered before they are immune. Okay. And my, um, this is shown on the timeline besides the portrait, so the two. Alright, well, I'm gonna heal you. Way, way, way. That's cool. I like that spit. Oh, I'm real heavy. Or does she smoke? Who knows? Time to end this. Slash and finish the job. Alright, alright. I can't wait to be able to fight my own fights. Pretty dope. Two credits. I'm sure that's the most money you can get in the game. Okay, my base just what I thought. It's been hit with some kind of EMP. Well, at least the coast is... <gasps> Teleported in. Union tanks? Have been researching that for decades. How do these guys do it? They may be more advanced than us, but at least we can take them out in a fight. Let's see how I do against this next one. Just remember your training. You'll be fine. <coughs> I apologize. Titan hand. Let's just scope it out. Well, I guess our ship didn't have to explode one of these Titan hands. A little lower now yet. Alright. This is where we fight, obviously. No, no. Oh, he's. It's a fire bat. I've seen a fire bat from StarCraft. I've played StarCraft. You can't trick me. Imperium will make you burn. Sounds like you use some ointment for that. Now let's try my cleave. Boom, resist, crit, but he... So he can't get knocked into the next round. That's what I just learned, because he resisted. Resisted, rather? Oops, that didn't work. Maybe a ladder touch. Let's try it here. All attacks have a poor damage type to this kind of attack. They are light, normal, heavy, flurry, AoE, combo attacks. Adversaries may be weak. A specific core type or core damage type, then take extra damage and delays from them. However, they can also resist or immune to specific ones too. Cool. So, all weak versus yeah, obviously. He's weak to weak attacks. Ironic. Now nah, slash him. I appreciate it, but I would rather you let me play play. His break limit is empty so much for delaying him. I'll have to defend to minimize damage from his flame attack. Defense. Alright. Shut down, that's alright. We're burning, but that's alright. I'm gonna see. Let's check your armor with Sunder. Yeah, that's that's alright. Armor absorbs damage. Okay, that's redundant. Is there like the map total attack, shield, and the armor? Yeah. Right? Am I dumb? Okay. Attacks that cause armor damage on a crit display the armor. Some attacks, so if elements can to pierce armor, while well, it doesn't damage armor, it can bypass some of it. Alright. Let the thunder, in the thunder. And we're gonna knock him into oblivion because we can't. So he's gonna break his armor. Oh, we can knock him into oblivion, okay. The armor's blue, we're not gonna finish him up with a crit with a slash. 
I'm assuming I'll get a 100% crit chance, baby, because I hit him beforehand. It's not like randomly percent. Randomly percent tile critting is what I'm used to. I could use those guns right about now. I got a trail of spiders. Uh-oh, I'm being called. Hold on. Spam likely. Rather that ease, little sis, to the rescue, I guess. Oh, that's my big sister, so that's probably who I had to fight in cinematic, if I had to guess. Okay, what? That was in game? That was weird why I couldn't cross the bridge for a second floor. Gargoon! I'm here! Saw a lot of action in Flux right now, it's mostly for training. Hey, hey, gun! Lady, let's move. There, a gun. Your sister needs a, a gun on. Alright, Dav, they're on. I'll leave these fires right to you. It'll be like shooting zub zubs in a barrel. <laughs> um, where'd the arms of the ship come from? I've got a bad feeling. What the heck is that? They even pull out something else to remote control of the guns. Sister! Oh yeah, we're, we're smith. Uh oh. Basilisk. I found what we're looking for, mother. He's as pathetic as he said he'd be. Who is he? We're gals, I thought. Kinda sounds like dad, right? The time for jokes would remember her fi find his weakness and point it again and again. Hmm, maybe I'm something like dad now. Use the special mode to view a unit's stats and who they're targeting. Alright, while well, I'm searching you can also view the unit's traits. Uh, when targeting an enemy, you are shown a prediction of the outcome of your actions on the enemy for that round. If your actions presumably so on the death of the enemy, then a kill shot indicator will be displayed. Alright, cool. Or damage predictions in the kill shot indicator are not always 100% accurate because many things heal, damage, debuff, the type of buffs can happen. Alright. Uh, on inspect him, alright. So he's gonna go for my, uh, you know, me. With his classic laser eyes. So, let's finally get to be out the rails during this little boss fight to see what we've learned. Alright, well. What is he weak against? What is he weak against? What does that mean? What is traits? Weak versus heavy attack. There you go. And this is the likes. So we're just gonna hit him with the heavies. Not easy. Oh, what? Well, she has blade throw? That's cool. A heavy attack? I don't know what's a heavy attack. Oh, you can't do the combo? Oh, uh, yeah. That's a heavy attack. So, hit her with that. Even though we really want to, like, delay him, right? You hit with a heavy attack. Because he should be delayed. Hopefully. That work? No. It didn't work. That's bad. Remember the combo attack we used to practice? The one we broke Dad's grab hopper window doing? That's what I don't know. Let's try to. Good idea. Just sure we've generated a fury first. Boom, boom, boom. You hear it's generate fury by landing crits and breaks on the enemy crits. Generate one fury, break, generate three. Combos are special moves that cause fury and are executed by two of your heroes simultaneously. Each combo is going to be executed once for combat. And it's something about having a relationship. I hear you. Oh yeah, wait, wait, who's the attack? You don't have to hurt you now. Um... You just... Don't go blow for blow, you know what I mean? Thunder... Is there a way that I can heal myself? Dude, this isn't the bleeding, but can we still put a bleed on him? That's so cool. 
whatever. Just hit him with the heavies, girls. Oh, I like that move. Broke him. He's broken. There's our free. There's the fury we want to generate, boys, girls. Sorry, ladies. All right, well, he's gonna be a jerk anyway, no matter what. So you can defend, and you can just hit him with another heavy. The lasers are dope. Holy sheep dip. I meant nothing. Alright, charging. Oh, uh, he's gonna do something really bad. It doesn't matter though, because we're just gonna hit him with everything. You know, he didn't have. No, he still has armor, so. Yeah, we're just gonna keep hitting with heavy. Whoa! It's crit heavy. He's dead. He's dead. Easy. I like the combat in this game. I know this is just a tutorial, so it's super easy. Oh, that ugly boy. The mysterious figure. Temporary setback mother shall soon have our victory. Oh, is this who we lose against? Yeah, we're gonna have to obviously lose. Stay back, wait, I'll take care of this guy. What he likes the prison he makes up in hideousness. Mother only wants you, Davion Sifex. She has no interest in the female. Oh, that's my brother. Oh, I love your girls. Oh, you're doing the solo, Dav. We need to work together to defeat him. Well, he's going for Dav only, so... Yeah, tell me, tell me more about yourself. Ah, the Herald. Weak to nothing. It's 44 armor. 1,900 HP. We have, I have 60 HP. Some could say, this is a fight we're meant to lose. Bent. Right, I will break this man. I will shall break him. Nice blocks. Easy money. Break your shit. Okay, I have nothing so far. <laughs> it was one turn! He said enough. Like, dude, there was only one turn. Rude ass. Let's do something like that. Drop, drop some armor. I'm not breaking the armor. Oh, wait a minute. I defended. It's not fair. This can't be happening. Mother, I have no jazz. Bring me back. I cannot last much longer. Oh, you coward. Yeah, you can't last much longer. You're gonna get another Sunder. Don't give up, Dab. I can't do this without you. Dab, come on, get up. Please, I can't do this without you. Oh, no, that's sad, boys. We're sad girls. I'm sorry. The throne room is where you can view details on the Imperium hierarchy and all the currently known leaders. Behemoth adversaries. From time to time, you will be brought here to witness events such as death, promotions, and direction with the Imperium. You can also access the throne room directly through the main menu. Okay. Adversaries are at least soldiers of the Imperium. They are stronger, tougher, and have unique special traits and abilities. They also have unique personalities, so no two adversaries are the same. Adversaries can also be promoted to evolve, grow stronger. Oh, is this like a. Um, uh... Yo! This is like a. Uh... Shadow Mordor! That's cool. Me? For what? He just has that thing. He's strong and staggers. What a threat. I don't know anyone else. It's very cool though. Very cool system. Alright, I think this is a good spot to end it. Meanwhile, that's right. Well, I said it's a good spot to end it. So I'm going to talk over this. Uh, yes, uh, thank you for watching Star Renegades. Very fun game. It is currently on Steam, $24.99. I'd say it's worth it. Uh, it's also on the Xbox Game Pass. If you have that, you can just bypass the $24.99 thing. Regardless, came out September 8, 2020. Published by Raw Fury. Developed by Massive Damage, Inc. Hey, published by Raw Fury, who also or is published by Raw Fury. 
Uh, most recent video, Atomic Crops. Hey, oh, isn't that convenient? By the boom, boom, boom. Star Renegades, it kind of came in blind. It's very cool the fact that it's, you know, a classic roguelike strategy RPG, but then there's a whole uniquely, like a nemesis system almost. And you gotta forge bonds apparently. I'm just glancing at my, like, at the Steam page notes. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. Um, uh, I definitely would recommend this game so far. I know I only did the tutorial, and I don't know how to speak, so I, no one's watching the video at the end now, so we're sad boys. Well, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, all that nonsense. Comment so I know that you're watching, because then I can secretly go, yeah, I like you better than the other people that I interact with. But anyways, love you guys. Catch you next time. Bye-bye. This thing is called Riding the Bull.